good morning guys good morning guys and welcome to today's video it is late yeah, and we are going down to do chores sam and i we're letting the girls have the day off after that big show good morning stella bella with your gorgeous ribbons good morning hey enough of that mr hey Second place. Mr. You Second place. Hello, Mr. First place. Yeah. <laughs> the cat and the dog. It's like. <laughs> He's like, get me food. You want food, little guy? I am excited. I'm so excited for show season to be over. I'm ready to just get into lessons and learning and growing and just regular. Like, who knew I was gonna need a break from the summer? The summer was crazy, you guys. We did seven shows, seven. We planned to do 11 and then one got canceled and then we backed out of one series. Oh, I can't open this thing without two hands. We would be dead if we had a chose to do 11 shows. That's just crazy. Comment below, how many shows did you guys do this year? I know seven shows is probably not that many for some of you guys. And for some of you guys, seven shows is a lot. Last year we did three. Three was nice. <laughs> but it was fun and I would not trade it for the world. Sometimes I like to just stand here and watch our girls eat. A lot of you guys are asking, when are we building Gracie's uh, or Willow's new stall? It will be happening soon. I have a budget and a plan. Um, first, the shelter, which will be coming soon. Um, and then the chicken coop, which will be coming next. And then the new stall for Willow. All in its place. All in its, all in its own time, right? Right, Willow? Oh, hello, sweet girl. She's like, leave me alone and let me eat my breakfast. <laughs> Look at her eyeball. She's eyeballing me. She's, she's like, hmm, does she have treats? <laughs> Such a good girl you are. Such a good girl you are. You guys, there's so many things that I wish that I had time to just stand here and tell you, but then our vlogs would have no action in them, and I hate that. So, but there are so many things. Like, I want to tell you guys what I learned about horses from having them at home. I think I did a video a while ago about what we learned about horses or what our lease horse taught us, but what we learned about horses from having them at home with us is so drastically different than anything else that I've ever learned. Like, the biggest thing I learned is the bond you guys always used to say the bond is the most important the bond is not the most important you guys it is not the most important the bond is the only thing it is the only thing that is important it's not the most important there's nothing else that's important except for the bond there was a time when i used to look at stella i, I told you guys i used to look at stella and she'd be like you get away all the time she was like that and now looking back i can see she's lost she didn't know she, she didn't feel connected to me. And now, when I come up to Stella, um, and I look at her, she looks back at me. When I kiss her, we share so many moments of compassion and love for one another. Like, it's just so shocking, except for when there's food. When there's food involved, she does not care about me. Right, Stella? Nothing's better than licking your bowl. Nothing. But before, before I would look at her and she would look away every single time. And now, when I look at her, she does that. <laughs> Stella, can you cooperate just for this video, please? <laughs> but now, lots of times, when I look at her, she looks back at me. When she sees me coming, she gets excited. Right now, it's time for her to go out for her hay, so she doesn't want anything to do with me. And she's trying to tell me that. Yeah, you're impatient, huh? But yeah, like the bond is the only thing. And I see, and I don't know anything about training. I don't know anything about making horses, breaking horses. The only thing I do know 100% is that without love and care, your horse is never going to be your horse, ever. Did you see the kitty there, Stella? Stella's like, let me go. If you're not going to let me go, I'm just going to go. I'm worried you're going to run over the kitty, though. I don't want you to run over the kitty, okay? Okay? You're such a good girl. I just love you. I just love you. She's like, I just love freedom. Let me out. Willow knows that Stella's time to come out, and she wants her. She wants Stella. 
Everybody loves Stella. Everybody loves Stella. All the horses love her. Gracie loves her. Willow loves her. Finn loves her. And you know the reason why? Why does everybody love Stella, Gracie? Hey, why does everybody love Stella? They love Stella because she's a calm, quiet leader. She loves, she's a loving horse. She accepts everybody for who they are. And she only intervenes when the horses act rude or crazy or need to be put in line. And she's so fair and so accepting of all the horses that they form a really strong bond with her. And it's the same for us. Aww. It's okay, sweet girl. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Don't scratch your head. Yikes. No. Don't do that. Don't do that. And the crazy thing is that it's the same with horses as it is with people. The only thing that's important is love. Like, I mean, it sounds so super simple. But it doesn't matter where you are in life, what your health status is, none of it matters as long as you have love and people around you that support you and care about you. It's the only thing that matters, guys. I want to do in our tack room is make each horse have its own section so each hook will have the name of the horse over top of it and then all their stuff underneath like all their saddle pads all that stuff because I don't, I don't even know what saddle is mine yet like seriously I have no idea what what is my stuff like I have to have it broken down you don't do your own stuff, I know I do do my own stuff but everybody touches my stuff because I'm not the only one that rides my horse yeah, obviously that's it with the white thing. Also, Sam, wait. Where do you think we should hang these? I really want to have my own so I can put my own stuff on it. I actually want to buy my own stuff. This is mine. Barn. It's this barn. Where do you think I could hang it? There's literally no place, is there? Back of the door. No, I don't want it on the back of the door. Remember, uh, snow comes in here. We gotta like, we have so, we have so much so winterizing to do. Well, here maybe. Yeah, I don't know. Once you get rid of all these. <laughs> I don't want to replace those because we still need all that. But I, I do want to go through it and organize a bit better. Anything you don't need. We need a bigger a barn. Box. What? Anything you don't need to go in a box. Yeah, I agree. The problem is, is that when everything's in a box, it's hard to see. And then I don't know what we have. And then when we need something, I end up going out to buy it. I end up going out to buy it. And I hate that. All right. So you think we're done? Fuck. Storm. Finn. Finn. Look. 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 Come on. Storm. I'm actually really happy to see the boys happy in the field. Look at this stuff. Isn't that a crazy bad weed though? Stormy boy. Come on. Storm. Finn. Come on, Finn. Come on. Finn. Storm, look. Look.
Sam. There's Amy Sam. Jen, the boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. See what love can do. Is it? Is it edit? Who did it? Oh, with the bird pooping on my head? I'm never, never gonna live that down. It is already getting on in the day. Gabby is up having a rest day. The horses are having a rest day. The dogs are having a love day. Um, I that you guys didn't get to see, but yesterday oh, I bought... Oh, diaper off two times. Yesterday I bought these secondhand boots and they fit me, you guys. Uh, they're not a perfect fit. They're just a teeny tiny bit too short. Mom. Anyway, I bought them secondhand, and they're Ariats, and I really like them. They used to belong to the same girl that um, gave me all that amazing show stuff, the pants and the jacket, and I'm going to oil them up and take care of them and get a boot. They are going to be my new uh, riding boots. I'm going to try them out. I love the half chaps. I have a whole video coming out on half chaps soon. A whole lot of exciting things planned for this fall, extra videos, and... I'm going to start taking charge of my riding experience. Before, I feel like I've always just been a passenger along the way in my riding journey, and now I feel like I'm starting to become the driver. I am going to look for another pair at the Royal Winter Fair this year, and if I can find a pair there that fit me, I'm going to pass these ones along to Sophie because they fit her perfectly. She tried them on and was like, oh my gosh, these are perfect. Pre-worn in boots are the best boots. Ooh, Gabby would love these. They're rose gold. Oh no, what's wrong? Oh my gosh. What the heck? So I really want for my birthday a weighted blanket. This one is 10 pounds and then you buy a cover and... But they have these they have these new things and they're called funny, compression having, blankets. Having a diffuser right beside an air cleaner. Mmm, <laughs> they smell good though. Smell that nice, smell that. Nice. Ooh, that's uh, yuck. I got a headache now. Oh. Yeah. But they're they cute cool. though. I'm yeah. They didn't make it look like a volcano. <laughs> yeah, I like it. And then you just put whatever essential oil in there. Yeah. Yeah, they're nice. You can buy salt. Yeah, I want one of those in. too. People believe salt. Will. I believe it too. Slime is dead. Slime is dead, that's but you know Sophia is going to want it. Yeah. Oh, that's what you need, a roto wipe. Why do I need it? Frank. Oh, it's a prank. Oh. Okay. Oh, I want this. I might get this, actually. This is fun. So you use beads to make the picture. It's gorgeous. It's like a fun craft thing. Yeah, too much work for me. Yeah, but the girls would love it. Do they have a horse one? If they have a horse one, if they have a horse one, then we will be sold. There. Oh Sign God. The Why? Why you gotta have the horse one? Look at this one. This one's so cute. It's a kitten and it comes with a frame and then you put all the diamonds on. I like it. Somebody sent me a picture of this before and I absolutely loved it. You can hang them up. Like they're neat. The pop we need to make these next for our store. For our Day by day. Why? What is it? Oh, it's a Put pop stock. So oh, pop. neat. So I'm gonna go to the mall because he tried to order, pre-order a cell phone for him and Sophie, and he changed the address. And they said you have to wait for 30 days now before you can pre-order a phone or go into the store. So Sam had to go into the store so that he could get them to change the address, so he did not have to wait 30 days. So now he can go home and pre-order the phones. But 
I found these. And I've been wanting to do them for a long time. They're called diamond paintings. Wait till we get home, I'll show you. I'm like, I'm gonna buy these only if they have horses. And they had two, they had three different horse prints to choose from. And they're gonna be really fun. I'm so excited. I got the girls both one. And they are different patterns. And um, they're good for homeschool. So the girls do like mindless activities like that while we do our read together. Like in the morning, I read to them from a book. Sometimes it's like a book that's more advanced than their age or just something that we would enjoy together. And I always like them to be doing stuff like that when I read and yeah, I'm excited. All right, so since you guys are such good sports, good morning, Sophia. I bought you a present, but I noticed that the- copy those Hunter boots. I did not buy you hunter boots, but most people do not start, answer, I bought you a present with it better not be. Well, it better not be, or else it's not a present. So, I had all these plans to like clean up the property and do the laundry and clean the house. Now it's raining and I'm like, hmm, let's watch a movie, let's just relax, okay. Are you ready? Is, okay. is, it, is, it, is it like tweezer thingy so I can catch turtles and like pluck leeches off of them so I the, the turtles come in. The leeches? You want to pluck leeches off stuff? Off of the turtles. Okay, this one's yours. Close your eyes. Gabby, come over here. What is Okay, this? look. What is this? What is this? Here, Gabby. No. Do you know what it is? No. I want to do it too. I got horse ones. Seen this, yeah, so you guys well, can we'll start it today. Video. Yeah, I thought it would be great, and you can do it for when Plus, I read together. I do this, I'm polishing my boots. I want to polish my boots too. So after you're all finished, you can hang it above your what your. Do I have to do? It's color. It's by little. Number, yeah. It's not color. It's little beads. It's so color by number, basically. So you, it takes a long time. I'll help you if you want. Let me. And you uh, take all those little beads and you dip them into this wax stuff, and then you put them where the colors are, and it turns out so Where's beautiful. The wax stuff? So there, that stuff is wax. So you heat it. I think you like heat it somehow. I have to read the instructions. And then look, this night, this thing picks up every single bead. This tool picks up every bead. So all you do is you pick up a bead, pick up a bead, and stomp it. Pick up a bead and stomp Ooh, it. Oh, pick up a bead, put it in wax. And then stomp it on, yeah. So let's see yours, Gabby. Do you like yours? Oh, did you guys want to switch? I no. like them both. Oh. Mine's bright and I like At least mine's almost doing a Spanish walk. Yeah, I so thought. Like let's see, show it. I thought yours suited you, you better, and yours so suited you better. Literally yeah, oh, that's yeah, totally that's storm. storm I know. Playing. For our turn to go in, he was yeah, yeah, it's so pretty. And then we'll hang them on your room. I'll frame them up for you if you now, do a good job. I am going to um, hang it somewhere in here. I love it. Yeah. So before we sit down to watch a movie and do this and figure it out, I want you guys to clean up this mess I of this room. It. Oh, oh, so um, and I got my little sponge. So people who want to see what Sophie got in all her prizes this weekend there's gonna be a video on her channel today we got a letter from a lady named sarah sarah sent us this little card she's 23 years old she lives in south carolina she has two horses a 22 year old paint and an 18 year old quarter horse cross and um she loves horses she's been following us for two years and she sent a really beautiful letter i just want to say thank you so much sarah for your letter and she also sent these are her horses Buddy and Rio. She also sent these adorable pictures of our horses and I absolutely love them. They all have their colors. Clearly she drew them. Aren't they stunning though? It looks like she painted them with marker. I am in love with these. They, tr oops, they traveled through the mail so well. And Storm, his is beautiful. They're all beautiful. I uh, um, said yesterday in yesterday's video that I want to hang up something on the walls down at the barn as we get organized for winter where we can put all our horses stuff specifically so like when Brooklyn's here she can just go in grab her horses stuff and knows where it is and hopefully I'll be able to incorporate these I should um, I'd love to laminate them and keep them because they're stunning thank you so much Sarah and for your kind words too I also got a letter from Kayla 
who says that um, she is a fan of her channel and that she follows us on all of our social media that she loves watching the, our videos and she hopes she, that we had a lot of fun at our on our camping trip. She rides a 17.2 hand high a Belgian draft horse called Jimbo and she rides western. She wants to become a western pleasure and a trail rider. And she sent us some artwork as well. Super cute. Beautiful. I feel in the mood to do art you guys. I want to color. Coloring is not for kids anymore. I don't know how she does this. Yeah, it's beautiful. I can't even color So bright well. and pretty. I Thank you know. so much for your letter too. I love it when you guys send us letters. Um, it helps me get to know you guys a little bit better. And when you send artwork, it's so super special. <laughs> Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.